Hey everybody and welcome back to It's Only Food with Chef John Polite. Today we are going to be showing you how to make a mushroom and cheese omelet. Cue the music. Thanks a lot for watching. If this is your first time joining us, please do me a favor, go down, hit that subscribe button, and then hit that notification bell to be notified each and every time I upload new content. All right, you clicked on this video to have me show you how to make a mushroom and cheese omelet. So let's go down here and check out what our ingredients are. We have got a half a cup of Parmesan cheese, two eggs, a mushroom blend of cremini, shiitake, and yellow oyster mushrooms, about a quarter cup of olive oil, and some of my Greek seasoning that we will talk about later while we're doing this cook. There is absolutely no prep in this, so we're just gonna go ahead and head over to our stove. All right, as we always do, you can see the mise en place right there with all of our ingredients. I've got our two pans that we're going to be using, and I've got the plate and the bowl and the spatula all ready to go for when we start cooking. So I'm gonna focus in on the pan, set our mark, And here we go. Turn your heat on, medium to medium high. I'm gonna go ahead and put our oil right on in there. We'll throw our mushrooms in there. Let those saute up. While that's going, we're just gonna get our eggs going in here. Back up a little bit. There we go. I'm just going to whip these up and have them all ready to go when we want to start our omelet. Meanwhile, our mushrooms are covered with oil now. I'm going to take some of this seasoning and put it right on the mushrooms. This is my Greek seasoning that I have on my uh, Etsy seasoning shop that I have. It's on my website down below in the description box. You'll see that along with all the recipe ingredients and measurements for all this. Please check that out. It's called my Greek seasoning, Chef Polite's Greek seasoning. It's very good, especially in mushrooms. There's a lot of things you can do with this too. Right now you could probably hit it with a little balsamic vinegar to kind of bring out more of the earthy tones in it and give it a little bit of acidic. Hit it with a little lemon juice. Um, there's all kinds of different ways to do it. But I've got, uh, you know me, I like to keep things simple and easy. So our mushrooms have sauteed. I'm just gonna set them over there. We're gonna put our pan right here. Get some more oil in there. Oil is covered. We've got our eggs all cooked. Just gonna throw them right in there. I'm sorry, not cooked, but all scrambled. A little salt, a little pepper. Just a pinch of my seasoning. And we're just gonna start moving the edges that are cooking into the middle and let the other egg come to the outside to cook and get underneath it as well. Make sure it's not sticking. Hmm, it's gonna be a different egg today. It's still gonna work out not as good as before. I'm gonna back out for the flip. There you go. Turn the heat off. Half the cheese inside. All of our goodies in the way of the mushroom in there. Take our plate and just slide that on like that. Top with the rest of the cheese. Maybe a little bit more seasoning. 
Now I'm gonna go ahead and finish this up, make it look real pretty. We are gonna take photos of it for social media, put those photos into the timeline here with some really groovy music, and then we're gonna come back and we're gonna taste that. So enjoy the music and enjoy these pictures. Omelet. I'm gonna open that up so you can see all the fillings in there. Oh, it smells insanely delicious. I'm gonna just take a little bite out of here, get a little cheese, the egg, and the mushroom. Mm. The mushrooms, earthy, savory, with that seasoning on there. Uh, cook perfectly. They're not too mushy and they're not too undercooked if you know what I mean. They're just perfect. The cheese is creamy. That egg is cooked just right too. So this is very very good. Easy to make. You can find these mushrooms pretty much anywhere in a store or in the produce. They've got different blends and stuff. This was the nice one that I used. No prep. Make it up. It takes about seven minutes to start to finish and you'll have yourself a really good omelet. Take care of yourselves. Thanks a lot for watching. Hey, I appreciate you watching today. Thanks a lot. Don't forget to check out that description box on your way out. Not only does it contain the recipe for this show, but it also has a bunch of groovy links. I have a gourmet seasoning shop on Etsy and also have a cookbook on sale. Those links are down there. Don't forget to check out the playlist I've got down there for how to create a cooking show on YouTube and also a playlist link for how to improve your channel and help it grow. Don't forget to like this video, leave a comment below, don't forget to subscribe if you have not done so already, and then make sure you share this video with everyone, everyone that you know. Take care of yourself. Thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you next time, right here on It's Only Food with Chef John Polite. Bye-bye.